Hey guys, what's up? It's Aposex here, and today I will be showing you guys a quick tweak here. It's nothing uh, much, but it is a simple tweak that's really cool depending on your needs and how you use your phone. So it's called Synchronicity. Uh, just type in Sync in City, and it should be a little uh, one with a little power tool to the left of it showing that it's a tweak, and go ahead and check it out. But either way, it is a tweak that allows you to use your iPhone or iPod Touch must be on iOS 4 or higher while, uh, sorry, while the phone is syncing with iTunes. So we're going to go ahead and plug it in and I will show you that you can use your phone while uh, syncing with iTunes mm -hmm. here. So let's go ahead and plug it in. We have iTunes open right here. So let's go ahead and watch what happens on the phone. It says, Synchronicity, during certain tasks you may experience light lag, which is nothing to worry about. If you're running an app that's being updated, it will be killed to prevent any data corruption. So it looks like we got the pop-up again. We're just going to dismiss it. It's the same pop-up. And it will have a red bar in the top corner saying that uh, a sync is in progress. Now, this app does not have any settings, but as you can see, you can launch you know, stuff like settings. You can go into mail. I mean, it might feel just a little bit laggy, nothing much, but that is because it's backing up stuff on your device, you know, syncing, this and that, uh, all that stuff on here. So it is definitely really cool app. That's really all there is to it. Like I said, you cannot, uh, if, it's, if, if, it, if it tries to update an app that you're using, it'll just quit it. So if you know one of your apps is going to be updated, don't use it. And another side note is that you cannot play or you cannot use the iPod app on here. I'll go ahead and show you that you can't because it does not want to have any data corruption on the device if you are syncing music. So it's not going to open the iPod app. So it just prevents any data corruption. And yeah, so that's it. Just an awesome tweet. Go ahead and check it out on City. I forget how much it costs if you'd like to pay for it. If not, you can get it in the Insanely Eye repo for free. So uh, give this video a thumbs up for the awesome tweak. Subscribe somewhere up there. Follow me on Twitter at Aposex and stop on my website at aposex.com. Thanks.